in this video we will see how to fix kv5049981 update not installing on your windows 10 system if this update is failed to install in your system then here are the fixes and the first and initial workaround is right click on a start button and choose settings in settings phase from the left sidebar go to system and from the right side look for the option troubleshoot click on troubleshoot this is an important tool of your windows system choose other troubleshooters and here run windows update troubleshoot click on run button against windows update and let the window complete the troubleshooting process it will not only detect the issue it will repair them accordingly so follow on screen instruction to complete the troubleshooting process and after that check whether windows latest update kv update installing or not if not go to the next fixes go to windows search and type disk cleanup type disk cleanup and open disk cleanup in your system and here select the drive you want to clean up basically c drive where your all, all program files exist and a new window will open here go to files to delete section and make the check against all these options recycle bin temporary files thumbnails use directory downloaded program files make the check against all these options and click on ok are you sure you want to permanently delete these files choose delete files <laughs> this cleanup uh, not only release extra space but removing catches and cookies and history of your system the next workaround to fix this issue is go again go to windows search and type cmd and open command prompt windows run as administrator mode click on run as administrator and in command prompt windows execute this three dism tool first in command prompt windows dism online scan help DISM online check help and DISM online restore help. All these three DISM tool execute in command prompt windows one by one, followed by enter key on each time. Simply copy from my video's description box and paste it in command prompt windows and press enter on each time. After that, execute the command SFC slash scan now. And press enter, it will scan your PC for any corrupted or bad system files and repair them accordingly wait till 100% verification complete after that restart your system and check whether windows update installing or not if not go to the next fixes right click on start button and choose run you may press win key plus r shortcut key to open run dialog box and here type services.msc click on ok this command will open services windows in your system services windows will now open here you will have to exit uh, start or restart various windows update related services and the first one is background intelligent transfer service simply right click on it and if you found it in a stop mode then first start it otherwise restart it after that apply a double click on it to open its properties windows and go to a startup type and set as automatic and click on apply and ok to save the changes the second services is cryptographic services look for cryptographic services same right click on it and first choose a start otherwise restart it click on restart and thereafter apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic click on apply and ok to save the changes the third one is windows installer services I scroll down and find out windows installer services same process right click on it and choose the start or restart and apply a double click on it to open its properties but you can't change its startup type so close the windows and the last one is windows update services right click on it choose the start or restart if already a start then choose restart and after that apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic click on apply and ok to save the changes after that restart your system and check whether windows latest update 
installing on your windows system or not if not go to the next fixes execute windows update components go to windows search type cmd and open command prompt windows run as administrator mode again open command prompt windows and here you will have to execute various windows update components one by one and as shown on a screen first execute these four commands to stop these four services one by one followed by enter key on each time in command prompt windows and thereafter execute some more commands windows update components as shown on a screen all this command path will also available in my videos description box you may copy from there simply copy it one by one and paste it in command prompt windows and press enter on each time so execute all these windows update components and after that execute these four commands again to start all those four services you have earlier stopped them so execute them and one successfully execution of windows update components close the windows and don't forget to restart your system and after that check whether windows latest update installing in your windows pc or not if not manually download and install windows latest update to do so open your chrome browser or any preferred browser and here in search field type microsoft update catalog press enter choose first appeared result microsoft update catalog and in microsoft update catalog page type your kv update which you want to download and install in your system click on search all its related kv update kv504981 49981 all its related update is available simply click on download button and install manually in your system various type of its related update available for your windows 10 system simply download it and install it in your system manually that's all